Agony. Right, you want to intro right. us, Rosa? Yeah, so welcome to the Jack and Daxter Precursor Legacy 2v2 Lockout Bingo. Uh, yeah, we've got uh, Aslov and G3. Introduce yourselves. Or say hi, at least, because I've just introduced you. Yo, hi. I'm G3. <laughs> and we've got Whoa. Stella versus Vortex. Uh, Stella uh, and Vortex. Well, I'm here. Vortex just went to go get a drink. So, uh... Good timing. Hello, yeah. I'm Vortex. Hello, I'm Stella. There you go. <laughs> uh, so, I think the main thing to note here is we have set up like very specific uh, save files. So, we've actually got 20 cells to start with, and we've got access to the entire map. So, we can warp to basically any level to get... Uh, any goal a lot easier because the game's locked behind cell requirements so this just makes it more fun uh, routing wise um yeah yeah that's it and uh, oh, and part of the save file is uh, we will have like a minute and a half I think it is or two minutes uh, of minute, just minute, black minute. screen minute 40 seconds yeah minute 40 yeah of literally just black screen uh, due to the way the cutscenes have worked out uh, where they're going to plan their strategies. Yeah, so there'll be a very, very tense lack of gameplay at the start. <laughs> yeah. Uh, where we get to look at the bingo card and figure out what to do. And then the screens will suddenly pop in and it will be all go go. Isn't it crazy? But, uh, are you back, Vortex? I am back. Right, well, we're live, so are you ready? I'm back. I've been ready my whole life. That's that's what I like to. I've literally been practicing every day for the last year for this. <laughs> I was born. Great. To play we submitted Jack and a month Daxter, ago. The precursor legacy two v two <laughs> ng plus lockout bingo. As your teammate, I'm so glad to hear that. <laughs> All right, <laughs> um, let's get to the portals and let's get started. Yeah, debug off. Sticks warmed up. Yeah, I, I never reset, so we crash, we crash. <laughs> Yeah, we probably oh, yeah, should yeah. mention there is a there is a there is a chance of somebody is going to crash, but it will happen within like the first two minutes. So, just that's like ten seconds, that. really. That's, that's that's generous. That's generous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Someone's Everybody crashing. Ready? Say I'm ready. Hovering I'm ready. Over the green sage. Uh, I need to find the portal. Uh, bingo board. <laughs> the portal. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> I've lost the portal. What do I do? I'm ready. It's... I'm working. Ready. Alright. I think we just need a countdown then, you alright? Yep. Yeah. Rose, are going to count down? Yeah, I'll, I can count down. Uh, so, uh, when everyone's ready, looks like you all are on go. Three, two, one, go. And good luck. GG. That's a callback and a half. That that is that, <laughs> So okay, so that it was how we started a tournament uh, race once was just Vortex going Yeah girls <laughs> uh, super loudly. It was hilarious. Uh, anyway, to the, on the bingo board, uh, we do have Yakals actually on it. Do we? Let's well, go. What are they going to um, race for? Do you reckon? Ooh. Well, there is them. all orbs and geyser. You know oh. how much at least three of them love all orbs. <laughs> Vortex was practicing that earlier while we were waiting. So could potentially have two people going straight for that. Uh, rats. Someone's gonna do rats. <laughs> oh yay! Rats is easily the worst 30, mini game. Uh, Thirty-five total cells. We'll probably be here a little while. Yeah. Do we have cell in every level? Doesn't look like it. Uh, not that I've seen. Yeah. Uh, die, die on Zuma, flat flat, and on foot. That's a super easy one as well. How much spider cave is there? I see two in spider cave. I think. There is a lot. There is a lot of spider cave. Jeez. There's a lot of snowy. Wow, there is a lot of snowy. Every blocker on foot. Let's see the troops. Complete flex plug section. 
I, I, it looks like it was only three. Oh, and we're off. Okay, so it looks like we do have Stella and Aslov racing all orbs in Geyser. Uh, like Aslov's having a bit of a better time with it so far. Yeah, and G3 has gone to Blue Sage and Vortex has gone to Red Sage, so... Okay. Just to see where this is going. Okay, so Vortex, Vortex is, is doing all off. scout flights. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> oh, and all G3's right. doing all scout flights. Ooh. Who will get all the scout flights first? Oh, 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 I oh, love... That's oh. All... oh, no! <laughs> I love having mild heart attacks. <laughs> you nervous. Well, yeah, it's I think like this is clear as love victory, yeah. While you're working on that nervous breakdown, can we give a couple of donations here? Absolutely. All right, first off, we've got $10 from Bargo34, who just says, Joel. Shout so, out to yeah. Thanks, Joel. And Bargo. And then we've got $10 from Roxy saying, or Rexy, excuse me, saying, offering assistance on Hitman 3 and Lego Batman was an amazing experience. Good luck, Team Jackson. Try not to break the game too much. Put this donation towards Team Meme for the Link D Link's Awakening DX run. Rexy understands. Thank you, Rexy. Uh, uh, I just quickly before you carry on, I just want to point out that Aslov tried to go up to Snowy. Uh, the one thing that isn't unlocked by the save files is Snowy, and uh, you still got to collect two cells before you can go up there. That's true. Looks like he's trying to get all the flies in the crater. Yeah, he's gonna... Vortex just finished that, so... I'm surprised Vortex took so long to do it. I wasn't much paying attention to what he was doing. Yeah, I think Aslov's still probably going to finish, just because he needs... If he's planning on going to snow, he needs those... Uh, yeah, he's going to need the power spells. cells for that. Uh, it looks like he's actually going in the spider cave, so it looks like he might try to uh, snipe out um, the six drilling murkers and possibly the pole cell from Vortex. Of course, he doesn't know that Vortex is in. So well, no, Vort Vortex looks like he's going to Snowy. Oh, he's going for Hidden Cell. Okay. Did he get the last Scout Fly Cell? Or did he yeah, yeah, he did. He left it there. He left it right there. So he can uh -oh. grab that and just go straight up to Snowy. Baller move. I like it. Nice. Stella coming up on Yakal's as well. Is it Yakal's? It is the cell, so he's also got to remember to talk to the farmer, which. Somebody famously didn't last uh, last oh, time. It, it happens so often. <laughs> He's punched the right way. That's fine. Right. Oh, and right, Aslov's right. going up to Snowy as well. Oh no! They're going to be racing there. It looks <laughs> like. So As Aslov is easily the best Jack one runner that we have at the moment. So. Oh, without a doubt, he has a full yeah. sweep of the boards. Yeah, full sweep of the boards, and he's working on... Oh, has he got it? He was he working on... He has all three 80% for the main trilogy. Yeah, yeah, so easily one of the best Jack Runners. <laughs> it's a perfectly balanced race. Uh, G3 disabling the cannon and Sentinel, so it's... Looks like he's probably going to go for breaking three orb crates without yeah. the cannon. We do also have all cells in Sentinel Beach, so I'm really... Oh. Worried why he didn't pick up that cell. Oh, his, oh he got the boosted, boosted as well. I know, that boosted made me so nervous. Oh, Vortex going for this strat. Oh, is he going to go for the three frame jump? Oh, he just missed it. Got greedy. <laughs> now he's got to climb back up to the cannon. It doesn't get eaten. Stellar showing off with some one frames. We should probably explain what some of these tricks are calling. Uh, probably. Uh, Alright, well, a one frame refers to the jump pads 
there is a one frame window that you can hit circle and get the spinning animation off of the jump pads. Uh, I believe it's, what, 15 frames after the X input, right? Uh, it's something, something like, like that. that? I don't know, I've never I, been I, good at I'm them. I'm pretty sure it's 15. Um, I do know that you can do it to the beat of staying alive. I think that's the song that works, right? No, I think that's CPR you're thinking of. Um, I, yeah, I remember it from it, the office it's, meme. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's Poker Face. Poker Face, that's the one. I was getting the, the office thing confused. <laughs> But the right. spinning animation helps to get a lower jump, which will get you on the ground a bit faster. Can uh, I sneak in another donor real quick? Yeah, Absolutely. please. All right, great, thanks. Uh, we got five dollars by our very own host extraordinaire Zeb, with the comment, "Had to donate to get to the funky number," and we're currently at one three three seven. So thanks for that. Nice. And oh. he's also saying, hopefully, I'll get a Bingothon mug, which is one of the prizes for a minimum of five euro, uh, dollars, not euros, dollars. Thank you very much, Zed. Back to you guys. You know what? I, I think I could do a five dollar donation. I like mugs. <laughs> it gets you into a chance of winning a Bingothon mug, one of three. Ooh. In our prizes. And also going to a very good cause as well. Yes. 100% of the donors go directly to Fred Hutch. Alright, so Aslov's just ticked off, I think, his first uh, first snowy goal. So now Vortex and Aslov both know that they're each competing for the rest of these goals. Aslov actually has two goals marked down. He also has the Lurker troops, so... Oh, did he get that? Oh, okay. Because I do know that uh, Vortex what? got... Did you just see Aslov get stuck on the rope to the bridge? No, but I did see a crab climbing up a wall on Stella's stream. Wall crab? I yeah, heard a wall, wall dog. Crab. Wall dog, and now we've got wall crab. <laughs> well, personalization, guys. All will become crab. Ah, that's true. Alright, it's Aslov. Another two frame trick here. Oh, he got it! <laughs> you have what? two frames oh. to do an, uh, do an uppercut there, oh. and it f pushes you through the ceiling. Nice little time save. Alright, Stellar's now gotten all cells in Sentinel Beach. Uh, let me see. So G3 looks like he's getting scout flies in... Okay, there is break five scout flies in Sand Ever Blue Ego. This is a yeah. famously hated goal. Yeah, it used to be seven, and that was so oh, difficult. Uh, it's, and, like, it's possible, but like just barely sometimes. Yeah, like it, it, what it used to be was we had to take Eco from us, uh, uh, Sentinel Beach, in order to actually have enough to break the one yeah. near the uh, Oracle. And yeah, it's it was a nightmare. Looks like you got it. Oh. Wrong goal. <laughs> Stella just marks off complete the fish mini game without actually getting any fish. Oh, Vortex! I think I, I think he did get it. So he got gone to the skip on foot. That's actually amazing. Truly, absolutely based. That's actually insane. All right. And he's gonna trip That's here trip. as well, isn't he? Yep. Yep. <laughs> and a second time. Yep. Yep. That's just the game's way of loading the next level. Going too fast, they gotta slow you down. And by slow you down, I mean they, they're gonna break your knees. <laughs> oh, Aslov's also going for on foot gondola skip. Looking good. Should be able to get this with no problem. Yeah, easily. Oh, huh. I thought he was about to fall in the lava. <laughs> I the falling in the lava is not even that bad either. You'd still have yeah, to yeah. He still respawned like just about the same spot, pretty much. But it still would have set him back a couple of seconds. Yeah. So what's uh, Vortex doing? He's going through mountain pass backwards. Hidden now... mountain pass cell without a skip. There it is. So that cell okay. that he literally just drove past. 
Uh, he's got to get that the legit way. There are, I think, four ways of getting it. Not legit, but... I think they keep evolving. I mean, because we have two different ways over to Boulder. Um, actually, not three different ways. You can do it on foot. You can just drive over to Boulder, apparently, and you can also hop on trees. There's stalagmite hops. There's just crouch jumping. And there's a legit way. So there's like six different ways then? Yeah. We have G3 and Stellar racing fish right now. Stellar is easily going to win this one out unless he misses a fish, which would be quite the blunder. Either way, there's a couple of goals in Misty that uh, you need fish for. Silently praying on this man's downfall. <laughs> it's not silent if you say it out loud. No, I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm stating what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm still silently praying. <laughs> there we go, so Stella's got that one. Blunder's a word. Oh, Aslov's right, killing the drill lurkers. Uh oh, okay. Now, this is a goal that I personally hate. Although, I guess at least it's not with Yellow Eco. Like, you don't have to do it with Yellow Eco. I think he just tried an infinite jump underneath that thing. That's what it looked like. What? I'm sorry, you killed him that soon? Oh yeah, basically as soon as the drill stops, you can kill them. You know, Tano, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't fully process what you were going for, but now I understand what you were going for. I've had a long time. My brain's a little behind. Mind if I check in with another donation here? Absolutely. Yeah. We've got five dollars from Jakeman951 who says, "Let's go, Aslov." Get that mug. Love to see the Aslov love. As love. <laughs> yeah. Oh. So now, one of the, the real question goal. is, have Sorry, any okay. of them been paying attention to cell counts? I was just thinking that, like, who has the most cells at the moment? Like, somebody has it, to get it's it. Gotta, it's gotta be Stellar at the moment, because he has all the Sentinel cells. And he also has Fish. Just, I need somebody to, to press either R2 or L2. I need to see a HUD. Oh! Oh, wow, Aslov's on 26 cells. Oh, wait, he already had... Aslov's got six cells. <laughs> I was just like, how did he get 26? <laughs> I forgot, forgot how this worked for a second there. <laughs> if my math is correct, Stellar should have 28 or 29. Also, he has pause. Oh, is he going for the Zeppelins? Yeah, he's going for the Zeppelin, so that's what he's doing. He's just trying to get these guys on the foot. Oh. Nice. So we have two runners in Misty, one in Basin, and one in Rock Village. Where is Aslan here? Uh, Boggy? <laughs> Right. So, 150 Aslov. orbs. Okay, he's, he, okay, he's got to have So, so oh. the big brain play here would be do the 150 orbs. Yeah. And then make a save next to the rats so that when it comes down to the, it being the last goal, which it almost always is. I just realized just that Stellar's got two goals in one. There's kill four Zeppelin lurkers on foot. Uh, I think he has three Zeppelin markers now, so he just needs to kill one more on foot, which should be this one, so he can move fast enough. Oh! But if he can get back to that spot where he just killed that other one fast enough, Just swim. Oh no. Oh, ah! What? Oh my god! He got invulnerable! Oh. 
He got ghosts. <laughs> <laughs> I think he genuinely got ghosts from that. <laughs> but did he get the Zeppelin? That's the thing I can't tell. <laughs> no, it doesn't actually matter did. because you can just... Like, once he kills this one, that's still technically four. You can just mark oh, yeah, right, the same not... one. Yeah, that's right. It doesn't have to be all in one. Yeah, he's but marked now enough. he does have to re-kill Zeppelins so that yeah, get Oof. the cell. He's not having a good time with that fish. Right, so he's back to six Zeppelins. Uh, looks like G3 might give him a run for his money. <gasps> no! Uh, Aslov didn't hit the blue sage switch. Uh, so oh, he doesn't get flut flut. That's, that's a rookie mistake right there. Oh, I don't know if it would be quicker, honestly, but... It still would be nice. Alright, G3 got the Zeppelin snail, sniping that out from Stellar. Right now they are neck and neck, both with 9. So let's see. So, either Seller or G3 is going to be getting 120 orbs in Misty. Uh, I'm. Who was it that it was. Okay, Vortex was in uh, Basin. I'm surprised that he didn't get the Flying Lurker stuff. I thought anything? that's what he was going for. What did he end up getting? I don't know. He didn't even mark. The last goal he marked off was in Mountain Pass Cell, so. Yeah. Unless he's just saving, marking that to really throw them off and maybe waste their time, but there's no way to know that whether or not they'd be in face. Alright, I do know for a fact Azlov needs 265 orbs, so he just needs two more and he's got the 150 orbs. And is he going to make that save file? Let's see. And if anything, we know that Vortex will have access to Flood Flood because he did hit the switch, otherwise he wouldn't have been in base. Yeah. I mean, I mean he I can think... get in the base without the super, but... Yeah. I mean, I don't think Flood Flood's um, needed. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Flood's definitely not needed, but she does make it a lot easier. Alright, so Aslov got the 150 orbs and Vortex is just noping out of there. I respect that. Yeah, I, I just saw Stella's got 29 cells. Now, I was not fully noticing. Uh, did Aslov make a save in Boggy so that he could possibly load back a few rats? No, he didn't, and it really bugged me. <laughs> okay. Oh, he still hasn't hit the blue sage, so he doesn't get <laughs> <laughs> the zoom And Vortex is now heading back in the base. Now, he's probably thinking that he's, or he might be thinking that he's racing Aslov, that or Aslov's doing rats. Although, I don't think that he would assume Aslov's doing rats right now. That would no, not be the play. No, rats takes like four minutes. Three minutes. It takes a long time. I think it's about three minutes. But he should, well, I don't know, I think this is the first time Vortex has played this game in months so we'll we'll see how all of this goes <laughs> i mean what all of our runners are perfectly practicing know to be prepared for upcoming events they don't I mean, wait until the absolute last minute to get a memory card <laughs> oh unfortunate death from stellar sniped At least you got a quick death cutscene. Yes, this is true. I'm curious to see who's going to get 25 scout flies first, as well as 35 subs. Yeah, we've still got all scout flies and lava tube to go, so Oof. it's going to be. I think yeah, well, got that. I think it's going to come down to um, possibly scout flies and um, oh yeah, scout flies total and in lava tube. I think it's going to come down to that a little bit. I hate to see it come down to rats. Oh, it will, though. <laughs> get that spell. 
Oh. What's right the now, as of the end? Three are 10, 11. 11 yeah, it's 11 and 10 right now. Wow, that purple team has zero goals. Wow. It's pretty base, not gonna lie. <laughs> I can't believe that our first match, we might see it come down to rats. <laughs> so on brand, though. <laughs> it really is. And no one is going to Lava Tomb. Which I still respect, honestly, because I hate that goal. Oh, oh, Aslov's going for this out of bounds. I love this. Oh. This, this. I can't believe this is only incorporated into the route, like... Wait, this he's going year. for rats now. It's not going to come down to rats? Dude, he's doing is, rats? Is... He's I, I respect him. He's choosing to be rats. I, got, I actually respect that, you know. <laughs> I do respect four the goals. Goal, but... When there's four goals left, you know, there's four people. It's a guaranteed win at this point. Like, it's a guaranteed I mean, goal that he's going to get. I mean, I guess I would hand all cell or 35 cells to G3, if anything, given that G3 was in set for collecting cells. Uh, who has how many cells, though? Oh, Cellar's going for the portal. I can only assume that means Scout flies in Lava Tube. Not a quick yeah. demo? Yeah, he's gone to Golem Eyes. Yeah, and yeah, go for it. Nice. You got another $5. That is uh, another one for the potential mug here. Uh, $5 by 10 Nim saying, Yakao? Isn't that what Lightning McQueen says? Nice. I love you. <laughs> oh, backwards lava too. It's a painful sight to see, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I just realized Aslov and G3 only need one more goal, and Aslov's doing rats. I wish nobody else is. Like, this is actually I'm them. surprised that Stellar is the one going for the flies and lava tube. He's the one that should have more cells. He has 30 cells. That's I don't even think this gives you a cell, right? I think this is uh, one of the ones that you give ourselves. It might be. I'm not a hundred percent sure on the top of my head. How many cells does Vortex have though? Is that there? I He's heading for his body. He must be. Okay. Apparently Vortex has 31 cells. Okay, so Vortex has more cells. <sighs> There's a lot happening here. If Aslov fails rats, you really think Aslov's gonna fail rats? The two rats that got very close to the vittles there made me real nervous. Angie, you know what? I want to get people's opinions. What do y'all think that those that's... are? Oh, and there it is. That's it. And they have a bingo as well. Hey, we, we actually... Well, that could have been a bingo for either team. I, yeah, it could have been. Actually got a bingo. That's insane. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say yes, done because it's 13 and I already won. Yeah. Oh hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, chat. Let's get some GGs going for our for this uh, first round. Nuts. Uh, first round here. Nice yeah, job. How close that was. Bingo and the finish there. Alright, so now we gotta get everybody back to Geyser. And we are gonna have to get everybody back in here for another countdown. Oh, Vortex looks like he might be having memory card issue. <laughs> uh, also on brand, I think he fixed <sighs> his memory card yesterday with tape. Oh, hi, Vortex. I was hi. suggesting you would I'm so upset right now because if my memory card worked, I could have done stuff. Oh, great. <laughs> oh, no. I literally just had to run everywhere. <laughs> like, oh, I couldn't do, like, save tricking. Oh, that's um, annoying. Oh. Yeah. 
So while yeah. you're looking for more duct tape, like, what do you guys think of this with the, with these boards? Like, this is one of the first times I've seen the Jack and Daxter right. lockout. So, what do you guys like about this? Um, not rats. Not rats. Yeah, <laughs> you, hate <to> see... <laughs> you really hate I, to see rats on a board. I can't stand the Akaz. Like, I hate them. <laughs> <laughs> okay that's a that's a hot take yeah this wasn't the best board um rat sucks 35 total cells is a lot uh you yeah. start with 20 so it's only 15 but usually we aren't collecting cells um there were four or three in misty four with fish so that wasn't too bad actually if there's one in misty then it, sucks, it's yeah. it sucks as a board because you're spending a ton of time doing fish just to get the one so you either it want zero misty or like five plus. Yeah, but, yeah. So anyway, <laughs> what do we like about the board? <laughs> well, the the multiple misty goals, which by yeah. the way, I choked so hard. I could, t oh, yeah. You yeah. feed me the oh, fish those... for like twenty seconds. <laughs> yeah, like, those literally. Zeppelins. Uh, yeah, I was. Ha Ooh. I had such a hard time killing four on foot. It's actually unbelievable. Oh wow! I just, yeah, because I started melted. going for orbs, and I got to the Ze the zoomer section. I'm like, he hasn't gotten it yet. I'm just gonna. Yeah. <laughs> go for I, the I, I I went straight for the zeppelins, and I still didn't like. Yeah, you got the cell <laughs> before I got all of them on foot. I think. Actually, still. Well, you only have to get four on foot. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Z honestly, I heard a lurker shark was pretty based. Honestly, <laughs> yeah, that was what? good. What did I do? Uh, you damage took damage the and then got eaten by the lurker shark and like gave yourself and... ghost jack. Yeah, I yeah. was really hoping that I would <laughs> that, that I would hit the lurker, but I didn't. But uh, yeah, but that would have been. Better. It's cool that I managed to survive the lurker shark, but then it just killed me right afterwards anyway. Yeah, All right, just created yeah. a new card. I thought I did pretty good, honestly, for. Not playing in a that while. Was, uh, Aslov honestly, got mad at you a couple times. Yeah, that's good, right? I was, I was fumbling. <laughs> like, I, mean, I fumbled I mean, to cave because I made a safety save in case you beat me to the cell. You beat me to the cell, like, a second, and I didn't notice it, so then I saved over it and right. ruined my safety save. You <laughs> made a safety save. I, I was really expecting you to save right next to rats while you were doing the orbs. And nah, you still I was ended all up in. coming oh, back yeah. to do rats. <laughs> Oh, 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 that. Well, well the I didn't expect was kind to of actually late. do rats. Yeah. I just. That was more, we saw we had 11. I was probably going to get Scoutfly, so we were like, just do rats, get the get the free one, because nobody else is going to be there. <laughs> I'm going to restart yeah. the game as well, yeah. by the way. That's, That's a good I, idea. I'm, I, got my, I got my memory card working, but I'm good. not going to touch it. I'm not going to touch it again. I'm not going to try it. <laughs> you know, yeah, you don't, you yeah. don't need to. Yeah, don't pull your memory card. You don't need to. Yeah. Oh. Give a little bit more tape on there. <laughs> this is unreal. Did you actually end up trying that? No, I didn't. I didn't end up taping. Okay. I just, I, I literally, I got a new memory card, so. Oh, but it's the new memory card. I have the new memory. Yeah, the new memory card's not working Ooh. either. So that, that sounds is. like it might be your PS2. It might be my old brick. Ooh. Yeah, the old brick yeah. that takes ten years to load the game. Yeah. <laughs> oh. The, I also. The thirty K. Yeah. <laughs> I think some pretty bad mistakes were forgetting to hit the blue sage button and Oh yeah, yeah. that was big. And I forgot I needed two cells for gondola. <laughs> oh rookie. <laughs> yeah, I remember we used, we used to um teleport to Red State instantly hit the button and then teleport somewhere else. Remember that used to be That's strategies. Right, that was the strat. Yeah. Yeah, I think I hit the red sage button and I thought I was good for like everything. So I, when I warped to blue sage I didn't even Think about hitting the button. Yeah. Right, we good? Right. Uh, everybody's ready? Let me get out of this guy. I'm ready. Yes. All ready to hit the portal? I am ready. Yeah, I think we're good to go then. Alright. Uh, right. One now. Oh, TJ, do you want to do the countdown? Back. Yeah. Alright. On go. In three, two, one. Go. Good luck. Geo. Geo. Oh, let's go. Nice. Okay, okay so immediately. Okay. 
through the fire. Oh, training oh, guns. Are they all dirt? I want to still I want to. I want to be. As love. Go, get there about, it is. Get okay. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately, we've got uh, destroy all eleven guys of training gu dummies on the right. So we're, oh, we're hopefully gonna race for that one because that goal is like fifteen seconds long. <laughs> we have collect light eco and four oh. sand shooters in Citadel. Oh, we also have. Um, I saw another. Geyser gold. Did I see a geyser orbs? Most of them have a power cell. All orbs and geyser orbs, yeah. So we have two geyser gold. Yo. So we have... ideally we'll have all four geyser from geyser gold. Uh, uh, we have... I've also noticed that we've got all bosses as well. So we've got Light Eco and we've got Defeat Claw and Plant Boss. Ooh. I like to see that. Uh, it looks like we have four goals in Misty at the moment. Uh, at least by my count. I might... Yeah. Yeah, it looks like four goals, so Misty's gonna be a good place to go. Yeah, definitely. Uh, ooh, full damage in four different levels is really, really fun. Yeah, it's really hard to keep track of, though, when you're watching four different streams, so you have to kind of go on. Yeah. We uh, get eaten by a shark in four different levels. Whoever goes to Hub 1 is probably going to take that. Yeah. Because uh, I think you do need to go to Hub 1 in order to get four different levels. Yes, because right. otherwise yes, you've only got only... Rock Village and... Um, and Boggy. Miss, and, uh, Boggy, that's the one. Oh, and we're off. And guys Okay, so Stella and Aslov are going for... Oh. They're both going for dummies. They're skipping the orbs. Yeah, G3 went for full damage off the portal, but I don't think he went high enough. I didn't see him take damage. Uh, G3 is getting eaten by the shark. Yeah, he's doing that now. Oh, Aslov snipes out the dummies. The real question is, is Stellar even going to bother with orbs? Or was he getting orbs in land? Nope, he was not collecting orbs, but he's going to try now. And Aslov isn't even going to bother with orbs, he's just dipping. Of course, Stellar doesn't know that. And I... he also looks like he's gonna cost him a little bit. What is... He has zero confidence that he's gonna be the one to get it, so he's just gonna go and get eaten by the shark. So we have three runners who have gotten eaten by the shark in Midgeyser now. Yeah, G3... Oh yeah, going for Hub 1, like as you, as you said. So he's got the other full damages and sharks. Is Vortex going to snowy? Maybe? I know there's no. I know there's all orbs here. Is it all flies or? Uh, there is all orbs and all flies. Oh wow! Oh, uh, there's all. G three is getting eaten by the shark in there. Let's move in. Yeah, absolutely. I think we should go for some team chats. Uh, you know, I kind of want to know what uh, G3 and Aslov are up to. Kind of want to know what. Oh. oh, fuck. Oh, oh, he got it. He got it. Okay, so I, it's because I died. I bonked on the rail and died. That's lame as hell. Okay, what am I doing in Spider Cave? Yeah, I guess two in Spider Cave. Oh, scout flies and poles. Yeah. God, no, they didn't do guys at all. I have to go back after Spider Cave. Yeah, so Geyser's probably open right now. This isn't as lively as I thought it was going to be. Oh, uh, is someone talking? What? TJ. Oh, is he just in here? <laughs> oh, we're doing a bit of a listen. Oh, listen in. Okay. No pressure. Whole no cell, so I just okay. gotta do. I guess we can tell you your plan. Uh, we got five in Misty, so I'm going to Misty. That's my plan. <laughs> nice. Simple as that. Let me do Spider Cave, then maybe go back to Geyser. If it's still open, since yeah, it's no still one did open. orbs. So I'm sure. I, I'm, I'm a mad I lost hands. crater orbs because I died. Yeah. Or I bonked on the roll jump on the rails. 
How are you guys feeling about this match so far? Um, this match in total, uh, I think we're pretty good. Vortex hasn't played in a while. Um, this this game in general, uh, it's hard to tell. Can't really tell what's gonna happen. <laughs> Fair enough. I think I think I should be ahead in fish, so I'll be ahead in the sit or the uh, misty goals, but I don't know about the rest. We got three in Citadel to keep track of. Oh, what was that? Did it Geyser. Did Geyser. Oh, okay, great. All right. Well, now you don't have to go to Geyser. So you're alone in yeah. Hub 3 for sure. Yeah. Might be able to go to Hub 2 after. I don't think there's a lot of snowy. I see one in snowy. How are you on Lurk, a Shark, and Fall Damage? Um, I've taken Fall Damage in 2. I'm going to take Fall Damage in FJ. Oh, I heard he could have. Um, take Fall Damage in FJ, FJ and Misty, and then Lurker Shark, FJ, Misty, and I'll be done. That'll be pretty easy. We're going to dip over to the chat, so good luck, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Wait, what the hell's going on? We're in the uh, doing a bit of this. Okay. Uh, okay. I don't actually remember where any of these scout points are, not gonna lie. Um... He just got all flies in Spider Cave. Where are you? Where are you right now? I don't even know where you are. I'm in, I was in Citadel. I tried okay, to do... Well, you, should, you should be good then. But... Doing the generators as well in Citadel? I, that's what I was trying to do, but I don't think I remember where any of them are. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> That's terrible. Do you guys have an overall game plan that you're going for at this, this round? Yeah, I'm um, at all class. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I pretty much said it. Um, I mean, I'm just hoping that G3 is not There's going one. to Misty. And he's, because if he is, he's probably way ahead of me. Because I've been messing around like an idiot. So, uh, yeah, I guess we'll find out. Alright. Any overall thoughts about the match? Um, don't die. Well, it's not. It's not. We were off to a better start the last time, right? I think. I, I think so. Yeah, we had a plan last time. Now yeah, we, we lost. <laughs> <laughs> we had a plan last time and we lost. Fair enough. And this time, we're just we're just winging it. Eh. We'll see how it goes. All right, I like to hear it. Um, oh, well, let's then get switch back over to the main chat. That we are raising money for the Fred Hutch Cancer Center. Fred Hutch raises money, where, and it's a research center where world renowned scientists and humanitarians work together to prevent, diagnose, and treat cancer, HIV, and other diseases. With three Nobel laureates among their researchers, they are at the front of the battle against these illnesses. So, hey, do that $5 and you can get a mug and feel good about yourself. Five dollars, that sounds like a pretty good deal. Yeah. Oh, Vortex just right. got Invincible Box. <laughs> You'd love to see it. Alright, so as Stellar was hoping, uh, or I guess rather not hoping, G3 is now in Misty. Although he's going to have a moment before he's going to learn about that. Oh, he's getting the muse, get the muse! G3! No, oh, he's going to full lap. Oh, I hate this goal. This is one of my least favorite goals. Because it involves going slow. <laughs> Why did we make this a goal? To force him who's, to go slow? Who, who suggested this one? They're banned now. <laughs> I couldn't tell you. So, so the, the Jack Bingo has actually gone through quite a lot of iterations. Like, it used to be... It genuinely used to be, like, w weighted by hub, so there'd be a, a load of hub 3 goals, but you'd also start on a fresh save oh. file, so you'd have to get... There, there's the first Ooh. Misty goal marked off, and Stellar is now just on his way to Misty. Oh, the fact that he was on the boat as he marked that off, so Stellar couldn't even pivot. 
Yeah. But now, he, now he pretty much has to double down and try to steal as many from G3 as he can. Oh, he needs to. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, which goal did he mark off? Uh, he marked off making me do a full lap. Okay. So watch out for uh, Return the Muse as well, because... Yes. Which looks like Stellar just straight up grabbed the Muse, which is a smart move. Um, looks like G3's... Oh, he's knocking down the bones. Uh, he just has one more, just, just just a little bit further than this. But it looks like Stellar is probably going for a Zeppelin's on foot. Something else. G3 played that so safe. The real question. Well, actually, if Stellar waits long enough to mark off goals, he could potentially set back G3 if G3 is thinking he's alone in Misty. But he did just mark off the four bones, so Stellar knows that he's not working on Zeppelins right now, so he can easily just knock that out and then take back the views, and he'll have sniped two goals from G3. Yep. And Aslov has just spoken to the Gambler, so that means he's going for the sub-39 Deadman's Gorge in the free square in the middle. Which is actually really easy to do, but um, just takes that little extra bit to set up. And then he's probably going to go for 400 total orbs as well, because uh, in this level you actually can get so many orbs really quickly. Oh yeah, good. That's an easy 200 orbs. Yeah. In fact, in the... I didn't like the, how uh... close Stellar was to that bomb. <laughs> Alright, so Stellar's gonna successfully have sniped that goal, and now he's gonna hightail it out of Misty. Because uh, he's gotta try to snipe out, um, return the views. So he's grabbing Scout Flies one of the ways here. There is 12, 25 total scout flies. And he took fall damage. Didn't, wasn't really necessary because G3 already stole that. But... Yeah, he did. I was going to say, he did get eaten oh. by the luck shot, but that's already taken as well. Oh, Stellar is just slightly ahead of G3. I think he's going to get the views back first. Assuming there's no delay on my end. No, I think you're right. It's the same with mine. Look at Azul just racking up these orbs. Oh, they are both racing. Yes. Stellar nice had a bit fella. of an easier time with that. <clears throat> G3's doing a quick pivot. Uh, let's see where he's going to go. He's going to load into FJ. Oh, he might go to fight him in that boss. Yeah, we've, we've also got Defeat Claw without losing any health, health yeah, as well. Yeah, I've just noticed that, so... The real question is though, who's gonna go and collect Light Eco? If someone does that. <laughs> and that'll probably be what it comes down to if we get pretty neck and neck. But Stellar and Vortex are gonna need to get a few goals to the catch back up. Looks like Vortex is going to head to LPC. He's probably going to grab orbs from both slides. I wonder who's going to talk to Amer and um, Uncle. I think G3 should have the orbs for that. He is already in Hog 1, although so is Stellar. Oh, it looks like Stellar's also going to go to try and fight the land boss. Which means he needs to hightail it to Claw to make sure he can snipe that away from G3. Yeah. Is Azulov just getting a quick 7 cell? A uh, 7 scout flies, you reckon? It, he might be. It looks like. Honestly, good level to get it in. And he got lucky yeah. with the RNG rocks. 
and it looks like he's heading backwards, so that's gonna put him in hub one. Oh, he's got the flies that he needs, so I think now he's just gonna go to hub one and uh he might just I just go for Mary. Yeah. I think he's collecting orbs as well. Do we know how many Oh he is on Oh, I was about to ask if he had enough orbs, and it's like, yeah, clearly. <laughs> oh, it's so trippy seeing this level backwards. I know. I'm not used to any of the connector levels backwards. No, is he going to death or... Ah, oh, save light, there it is. I don't think the zoomer was hot enough to make it worth death warping. <laughs> Going to jungle? Did he do claw? I don't remember him doing claw. I don't either. Unless he's just going to try to get orbs. There are better places I mean, I, to get orbs, right? I, yeah, I would go to Sentinel for yeah. to have one before I do the FJ. Like he's got the like, two oh. vents. Yeah. We have the two vents and Sentinel. There's the one vent here. Yeah, but it's so far away. Look, he's got to go all the way around. Now he's going for. He's genuinely going for orbs. And there, there's already a Sentinel goal. There's all cells in Sentinel Beach, which I will say <laughs> it's not the most ideal goal to go for, but <laughs> there's reason to go to Sentinel. <laughs> if your partner's already been the F shit, not much reason. Yeah, well, he he's got the 400 orbs. Again, they only need one goal. Which so, G, which G three is about to get either one or two with this signal fight. But we'll see yeah, how well, greedy he is. If he takes damage, we'll see if he decides to just restart the fight. Well, no, I don't I think, think he'd be that greedy. That wouldn't be the smart move. They only need one more goal. Yeah, I think I think it's on Aslo. Like I think he's just gonna buy the uh, mayor and uncle cells. Which one's gonna finish first? The claw fight or Mayor and Uncle Sells? Well, uh, hello there, my Mind if we break in a moment here? Me the most yeah, go for it. Moment, uh, so first off, we want to remind everybody we are still $30 away from unlocking the super weapons for our next run, the Link's Awakening DX. I would have pledged my but word more importantly, of them. for Zanaris and I, we have the hit the end of our shift. So thank you all so much, we appreciate all the donations, we appreciate the great runs, thank you guys, take care, and you want to say a few things? Uh, yeah, thanks for having me, Bing with it's always a pleasure hosting here and there. Have fun enjoying the rest of the event. We're going to leave you in the capable hands of Ganon here, and we will see you tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you very much, guys. Have a good e evening. Thanks, you two guys. Alright, so we have Uncle Cell. D3 doing the best claw strat for uh, not taking any damage. I still think it's going to be close as to which goal they're going to complete first. Uh, Plant Blossom Claw or Marin Uncle Cell? Well... Well, I think we decided that it's Mare and Uncle on the cutscene, so that should be Aslov winning now, right? No, he's he hasn't bought the he's, cell yet. He's on, he's, the, a... he's on the first talking to. Oh, of course, he's on the first talking to. Yeah, and so it it's going to be close. <laughs> it's going to be <laughs> It's the claw. It's the claw. <laughs> Oh my god, I cannot. <laughs> That's funny. They, they win 14 to 8. Out. I, I also like to point out Stellar saying the comeback is real and then immediately they lose. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you're, you're probably going to get Mayor and Uncle. Oh, GG. Dude, GG. I got absolutely destroyed. Ooh. <laughs> Were you yeah, just following every, me, Stellar? Apparently, <laughs> every turn. <laughs> apparently, I was following you at every turn, and I think what screwed me up is right at the start, I really 
I was really slow at the very start, and so I was just behind you all the time after that. Oh, yeah. If Stellar listened to me from the beginning... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I told him not to go for anything in Geyser, and just go straight for Misty. <laughs> oh, did you- did Aslov get Geyser? Yeah. Yeah, I was going uh -oh. for dummies, because he beat me on orbs last time, so I was like, well, he's just gonna do orbs again, because why wouldn't he? <laughs> no, he's <laughs> not dummies. Uh, we just got lucky there. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, I, got, I almost stole Vol or Crater Orbs that bonked on a rail. Yeah. Well, maybe right. the bonk then. Are we doing uh, a third game? Yeah. Should we get ready for that? Okay, we do I'm, down, we I'm down for a Yeah, I'm game. down. I feel like yeah. I feel like me and Stella are like ready now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what, are we ready to start like? the actual match now? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, the game starts the, now. The pre-match just finished, right? Like, Do we have time uh, for a third one? That was a pretty fairly quick one, they not? That was quick. Yeah. There's some things I do that look so great, and there's other things I do that are just so bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. To be fair, the whole time I was trying to concentrate G3, G3, I have Vortex telling me that he doesn't know where the flies are, and that he doesn't know where the generators are in Citadel. Like, <laughs> you're, you're playing two well, different games. <laughs> <laughs> when we tuned into your chat, the very first thing that we heard was Vortex going, so how do I do scout flies in in, in Spider Cave? And it's like, oh, oh there it is. <laughs> Fantastic. All right, so I haven't heard anything, so I assume we're good for a third match. Okay. On the, on the one yep. hand, uh, if you end now, we'll be super closer to back on schedule on the other hand just play the game i ain't in charge here i'm the villain that's good <laughs> let's play <laughs> he Ooh, said let's play, play. Don't worry. on average like how much time do we have like left uh, whatever let's just, let's just let's start how quick long, how long so, does each match take it's only like 20 minutes like 20 right? minutes yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. 20 minutes to the third, yeah me and vortex are gonna win so quickly that it won't even matter we're actually we're actually, we're we're actually yeah we're gonna get <laughs> Quote me on it. We're done. Right, Twenty minutes is okay. Guys get it cool. going. Yeah. Ooh, hold on. Hold on. I'm oh. I'm getting oh. notice from people who are in charge uh, oh. that we are actually going to go to a transition and try and get a little bit closer on schedule. So no. Big Ten Oof. champions are going to come away how, with the victory here. That's how about a six-minute we'll first to five in a row proper Take bingo? It. Stop. It. <laughs> <laughs> guess not. Guess not. I, 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 <laughs> all right, we'll, GGs. We'll get our redemption next time. It's all right. It's fine. I yeah. think we did pretty good. I just, yeah. <laughs> we did. We did a lot better the first time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Sally, so you just got caught behind me, I guess, <laughs> and that's that's what happens. This is so sad. Yeah. All right. All right well, I mean, it right, was yeah. still a great laugh. Though. Well, thank you, Bingothon, well, for having yeah. us on. This was really fun. A little chaotic, but it was very fun. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, absolutely brilliant. And sorry, yeah, next thank time, you again. Next time, Vortex will be ready and we'll we'll win. <laughs> hey, yeah. All right. Cool. Under the bus we should have just paired me with Dazzle because I think that yeah. makes the most sense. <laughs> uh, <laughs> if I made a little bit more sense in hindsight. I w it was like thirteen to twelve, or it was going to be thirteen to twelve on mass. So it was, it was pretty yeah. pretty close. Oh yeah. Harv's just brought up in chat. Uh, Jack turns 21 tomorrow. <laughs> Jack can oh, drink really? tomorrow. We can buy him a drink. Let's go. Oh, yeah. are, we, are we allowed the little self plug? Yeah, that was it. What's that? Jack turns 21. That was the plug. <laughs> no, no. It's weird. Yeah, we're celebrating Jack turn 21 by getting the Jack community to play anything but Jack and Daxter. Oh, tomorrow. that is true. Yes. Yeah, we are doing that. But uh... Oh, wait, wait Aslov, when do I have to commentate your run? Come on, guys. Uh, you know, Sunday, you Sunday, Sunday. Sunday at the same time as this. <laughs> guys, guys, come on. <laughs> All right, all right. We're done. Are we still, we're, we're, not, we're not live, are we? Uh, yeah, I think we are. <laughs> yes, we, yes, we are uh, still live. Hello, no, everyone. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. I'm a famous uh, yo-yo winner. I can do some yo-yo trick. <laughs> uh, Pingothon's never going to have a son again. <laughs> Honestly, don't bet.
what is it for you that constitutes a fun and engaging goal versus one that you think may need some rebalancing? Really, the only time I've ever actually considered a goal that would be in need of rebalancing is if the existence of that goal directly counters the collection of another goal. So like have one spot on the bingo board, say, have this item in your inventory, but then have another bingo spot in even the same row or column, say, trade away that item, which would in turn cancel out the original spot, which was uh, an issue when the bingo board first came into play. So like in Link's Awakening DX, you get a mushroom to get powder normally in the base game. So in the randomizer, we find the mushroom and then we still trade it away to the witch and she gives us another random item. However, these can both end up being bingo board spots, you know, have the mushroom and trade the, the mushroom for the witch's item. And if you trade the mushroom away, it takes away your mushroom trade item. You could just go get another mushroom from the forest after that, but it does feel a little funky doing it that way. And there have been other goals, especially trade quest goals that have that same thing, but it becomes a more permanent thing. Like if you use a glitch to skip getting a certain item of the collection sequence and then you try to go back and get that item like it doesn't count so that can break a bingo board sometimes are you struggling missing your regular farts have you tried going online visit exotic destinations Move your dreams, whoever you are. Apply today. No skills, no worries. Everybody's welcome. You're hired. Open a door of new opportunities. Work alone or with a friend, or two or more. You can do it. Move locally or connect together online. Yeah! Nice one. Coming 2023. Winter 2022. My name is Ganon 11. I slipped in there right at the end of the Jack and Daxter face off. And once again, congratulations to all the runners on both teams. That was a ton of fun to watch. And close match on the first one. Seems like a little bit more of a blowout on the second one. But definitely excited to be able to watch that. Now, Bingo Fun is raising money in support of the Fred Hutch Center for Cancer Research. They've earned themselves a global reputation for their track record of discoveries in the cancer, infectious disease, and basic areas of research, including very important advancements in bone marrow transplantation, HIV and AIDS prevention, immunotherapy, and COVID-19 vaccines. And now this part isn't on the little script that I have, but I did go ahead and look them up on Charity Navigator to see what kind of a reputation they have. Uh, and I was very pleased to find they have a 100% score. So they are who they say they are. They put their funds towards the programs that they claim to support. So they're the real deal, y'all. This is a worthy cause. Now, I do want to tell you a little bit about our next run. Now, you see, you're going to hear some information from the runners. And I just want to make sure that, you know, the Ganon story gets out there first. So the next run is going to be the Legend of Zelda Lunk's Awakening. Now you see Lunk is this guy, right? This guy who, you know, shows up out of nowhere. All right, look. So I've established legitimate government in the castle of Hyrule. I was the duly elected leader to follow the king of Hyrule, according to all the sources. 
And then this guy in green shows up and he starts beating up all my generals. He starts tearing apart my house where I've stored all my nice items, steals them all for himself, then comes and seals me in the Shadow Realm. What's that about? So anyway, that's where I'm hosting from. And this Lunk guy, not satisfied with, you know, overturning the legitimate government of Hyrule, decides he's going to sail off to this island of Koholand. And, uh, yeah, we're going to see what Lunk ends up doing over there. But I guarantee it can't be very good. I mean... It couldn't be it couldn't be as bad as him just deleting an entire di island out of existence. That definitely couldn't happen. So, you know, surely, surely things will be better uh, in Kahul than it was in Hyrule. Anyway, during our break, we did have a donation come in and it was from TJ donated five dollars towards Fred Hutch and said, and I quote, gaming. Thank you very much for your donation, TJ. Again, 100% of your donations go to the Fred Hutch Center for Cancer Research. I don't make any money off of this. I'm making money off the taxes of uh, Hyrule. Or I would be if Lunk hadn't kicked me out. Anyway, we're going to have that next run. Legend of Zelda Lunk's Awakening DX Randomizer. Blackout Bingo. Pink Batman versus uh, another person? Or is it just... It's just Blackout Bingo. We're going to have that run for you as soon as we can. We hope to have this break over really quickly. And stay tuned. It's going to be a good one. See you on the other side of the break. <laughs> 